Gentlemen, ladies, boys, and girls, cats wearing birthday hats or cowboy hats in this situation. It is day number one of the Jacob Zane playthrough. That's right, Jacob Zane. What we're going to do on this playthrough is only use Jacob's weapons. Whatever grenades, class mod shields we find, those are fine. There's not enough jacobs manufactured stuff that we need to worry about that we will be going after a jacobs company man the rules of this playthrough are as follows we're going to start a brand new character level one we're not doing the level 13 skip we will have no guardian rank until after we beat the game the goal of this is not only just to use jacobs weapons it is a completionist run for jacobs weapons so we're going after every name jacobs item in the game let's see how many there are because i can't remember a lot of boring math later so there are 61 named jacobs weapons that we need to acquire during this playthrough we're going to work on coming up with a really good build to fully utilize jacobs weapons to the best of their ability he's yeah. trying to help me whoa <laughs> get a haunted now we just need a monocle you can do it <laughs> well 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 that was nice and easy we do need to farm the tk's wave come on for real are you for real? Luckiest playthrough ever. Monocle really trivializes this whole freaking thing, doesn't it? Oh, Lou Midget. Damn, we one tapped his ass. Oh, Lou Midget, what you got in this backy packy for me? I thought that was a Lou Midget, but apparently it was Terramorphous. Man, there's no door on this elevator. That seems very unsafe. Oh, rest my case, your honor. Great. Oh my God. Oh my god, we got a nice stagecoach, dudes. <laughs> like I said, we didn't need to farm the tidal wave. We'll just get it out of a chest. Wow, those pants are tight. <laughs> Drunk William got butt plugged to death, guys. Now we're talking. The pea shooter is going to do some work, guys. I don't know if you guys have ever used the pea shooter or not. This thing is kind of stupid. And also, it looks really cool. Watch me not miss this. Nope. Damn it. Nope. Damn it. Nope. Damn it. Nailed it. All right, time to get a, a Robin's call first run, guys. Continue on with the uh, amazing luck. Oh. Well, well, well. Our luck continues, boys. <laughs> are you for real? Are you for real? We are getting first runs on everything. <laughs> Got our stone thrower already, dude. I want to go get the trick shot and I want to get it early so that we have it out of the way because I'm not a big fan of the trick shot. Those of you guys who have never seen me do an arms race before on Allegiance run, I don't even use other weapons while we're on a arms race run. That makes it extra challenging. Daddy needs a Jacob's pistol. There we go. All right, we're in business. Oh my God, he put his arm up right in front. <laughs> Look at all the red dots on the map, dude. Nope, nope. What nope. the hell? What the hell was that? What the hell was that, dude? What a crappy pistol that was to get. <laughs> Another damn tizzy, dude. Why? This is the run right here, man. This is definitely the run right here. We're getting a trick shot on this run, guys. That's not even... What are you doing to me? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> I just knocked them both off the building. <laughs> damn, dude. <laughs> Dude, this scatter gun is the tits, man. Holy crap. Got a bat. Uh-oh. <laughs> Sorry about that guy. Well, let's see if I can knock this guy off the map. Oh, okay. God, this thing is great. We'll leave you alive. Who knows? We might need you. Don't want to get too cocky, you know? Somebody, he dropped something over there. How about it? Oh, oh, he dropped something over here. Another tizzy. And what'd you drop? Oh, 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 a kick charger. How about a plasma coil, buddy? Nope. How about a plasma coil there? Okay. Nope. Damn. Oh, great. We got revenants. They weren't ready for this. They weren't Yay. ready for this. Damn. I launched his ass. <laughs> he was off the map, man. Oh, you little. Bro tried to Mr. President for his dude here. Didn't work out for him. Hey, there's a barrel. Found it. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> Butthole. <laughs> How are we gonna get this stupid trick shot, man? I don't want to spend all day in arms race. Let's all ask. I'm ready. Here, right back at you. <laughs> he got himself. All right, we got this. We got this. He didn't. Yep, yep. Take a calipine. You guys want to see my peen? That's the cutest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Peen! Peen! 
Who else wants peen? I volunteer as tribute. Why have you forsaken me? Our peen is out of ammunition. Happens to the best of us, guys. Listen, sometimes, sometimes you need to use a little something to get that ammunition back. I don't know anything about that. Yeah, my peen ran dry. Listen, you can't you can't use your peen all day and not expect it to, to not go dry. Huh? Nope, 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 oh nope. Oh my, okay. <laughs> I don't want to talk about that one at all. One more run, you have a feeling? For you, Nate Jiu Jitsu, I will suffer. I see a little red chest full of crap. It's got a moosh, got a moosh. Where's all my Jacob's guns? All right, buddy, here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Nate Jiu Jitsu was right. We got it. Two red chests. Oh, there's multiple legendaries in that. Infernal Wish. <laughs> okay, well, you know. Oh, damn! What the hell? <laughs> oh, snap! I'll take a spy! Oh, I got four skill points! Oh, my God! How long were we in the arms race? All right, so the stone thrower, I told you guys this the other day, but if you hit body shots, it ricochets. If you hit crits, it doesn't ricochet. It's very much kind of like a bizarro Jacob's weapon, you know? But it is now uh, six levels under leveled, by the way, because I might have spent a little bit of time in arms race. It still don't work, though. Hold on. While we're here, you know what we need to go get? Gotta go get our shoddy. Oh, yeah, we got the shoddy, boys. I'm so pumped for this thing. 100% genuine fake-ups, boys. 100% genuine. Can't make that stuff up right there. Yeah, look at that damage. Look at that damage. Bro, guess what? I've got a, I got a fake-ups. about to ruin all y'all. <laughs> she was trying to say some of these are warning shots, and then I murdered her with a fake-ups. Oh, you feel stupid. So the trick to using the fake ups is get right up on, on top of anything you're trying to kill. That's your only chance with this stupid thing. I forgot what this gun's called that we get from this. So we got the Gatlin Icebreaker. Forget you, Stone Thrower. Holy sh... <laughs> this thing is great on normal mode. <laughs> they don't pop up very often. You're already crazy. Whoa! 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 What the hell? <laughs> She's a witch! Ha ha ha! That's one less thing we have to get in the base game. Damn, wagon wheel doing work, guys. Did I just shoot that? Did I just shoot that grenade out of the air? I'm gonna need you to maybe slow mo that footage. No. <laughs> a little skeet shoot, baby. Oh, two skeet shoots, nice. The legend himself, McSmugger. Go get it. I remember this is the trap. <laughs> You're not getting me this time. Oh, crap. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, legendary. Oh, ho, ho, ho. level 15. Holy crap, another legendary. Well, well, well. <laughs> yeah. And now. Time for K6 out of context. I will take a duke. <laughs> that was level 15 as well, wasn't it? Son of a bitch. <laughs> How come our wagon wheel is level 21? What the hell? Like, Smugger, you're a dick. For that, we get a level 15, I'm guessing. Level 15, yep, level 15 chalice. Great, thanks, game. Critical kills cause the next magazine to deal 100% increased damage. Level 21, all right, cool. Hey, where'd you go, my guy? Why are you way down here? Where are you going? Are you trying to shoot a gun that you don't have? He's trying to shoot an invisible gun. Look at him. How the hell do you shoot slim around a damn corner? That guy is definitely using a Jacobs. All right, now we got this guy. Quick draw. Instantly reloads and your damage is buffed for a short duration upon swapping weapons. Yeah, it's a little bit of damage. All right, let's use the splinter. Yeah, it does. It does pretty good. Well, look at that. We got the nibble jack. <laughs> Level 25 nibble jack. Nice. When you jump, it gets much, much more compact. So being airborne makes this gun more accurate. Mm -hmm. I missed. Oh, ho, ho. Woo. <laughs> this game is amazing. Let's see what Ellie's got on here. I say chaos. What the? Classic. <laughs> she said classic. Woman, nibble jack. Nibble, it's, it's my simple jack. I'm gonna change the name of this gun to the simple jack. Never go full shotgun. 
Bro, that long range shot was sexy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Dude, I like the quick draw. All right, it's time to go get our Garcia boys. All right, so what we want to do is we want to trigger the save station that is right here on our map. And it's right beside the door to the anvil. And we got to run across the map over into this area right here. And then we get to fight Chonk Stomp, who can drop the Garcia. Naturally, he is going to drop it on the first run, as that has been what's happened in this entire playthrough. All right, Chonk Stomp, you owe me one Garcia first run. No big deal. <laughs> Come on. No way. No way. What the hell is this playthrough? Dude, Brick hasn't got to punch a single thing, man. I think he's starting to get pissed. <laughs> We're on the blood path now, boys. We need to go get our finger biter that we'll use for about one second. I don't care. He's going to give me a Jacob shotgun, so shut up. All right. Now we get the finger biter. Blue it looks like the Hellwalker in terms of like its shape. Fires heavily arcing slow pellets that bounce off surfaces four times. All right. Let's see if we can kill anything with it. Man, this gun sucks. Doing more damage with my impaler. I actually love this gun, dude. I actually kind of love this gun. <laughs> Look at the Garcia. Garcia just tore him up, dude. All right, hey, good news, guys. We got a new Jacob's gun to try. The Dastardly Hand of Glory. You guys know this gun is a just an absolute beast of a weapon, right, guys? <laughs> this is, oh, boy. This gun is great, dude. It's so, so good. His trench coat has gone through the front of him, and it's now a smock. <laughs> Wait, hold on. This means... We can finally see that clay ass. Y'all never thought that it was possible, but we got the clay booty. Oh, we got a loot jabber, AKA thieving jabber. He didn't drop a squat. All right, guys, it's time for the rogue sight. You know, the first time I used the rogue sight and I realized what it did, where it would like show like hidden caches, I thought, okay, this is going to be useful somewhere in the game. So I took a rogue sight and I went through like pretty much the entire game looking for stuff. There's nothing else. It's just this stupid mission. I was so disappointed. I do love that the bullets will kind of curve on this gun. Like, watch. I'm not going to aim straight at him. See how it like, kind of curves to him? <laughs> Poor dinosaur. Yeah, traitor's death. Woohoo. Never been excited to get that until now. Hey, we got the baggie! Just in time, we ran out of ammo in our Garcia, so that was great timing. The Maggie, level 29, three levels under leveled. Perfect. Damn, yeah, really, you had no chance versus the Maggie, did you? Not today! How about the Garcia? Oh yeah, she doesn't like the Garcia. She dropped the Ice Queen, sweet! I didn't actually expect her to drop it. All right, traitor's death. Let's see what you can do. All right, that was all right. These guys are level 29, so makes you look better than you are. Good fight, guy. Naturally, he drops the link now that I don't want it or need it. All right, and for that, we got one of my favorite guns that I never really use to do anything because it's not really a kill enemy kind of gun, the Dead Chamber. Dead Chamber is missing what I would consider a barrel, <laughs> but it does have this cool effect. All right, when you go to reload it, watch the reload animation. This is the coolest shit ever. How awesome is that? Well, there we go. That was pretty quick. Companion. Companion is uh, a rare elemental Jacob's pistol. Hey, Unforgiven. Are you ready for this, guys? Ready? Well, you weren't supposed to fall out of the car. We got the low end of the critical hit damage. But if you hold this gun in your hand and do crit damage with either your Mantis cannon or with your clone, I think even counts for this. If your clone hits crits, then you get that crit bonus. All right, hold on. What do I want to kill this thing with? Let's try the uh, the dead chamber. It's almost out of useful range at this point. Yeah, I just love the reload on it. That's all I care about. Wow. First run, we got a freaking impaler. Let's use the companion. Some fire damage. Yes, thank you, baby Jesus. Six pound, eight ounce, little baby Jesus. We finally got it. The Huntress. Good news, now we're on to the next farm, the Sledge of Shotgun, yay. Oh, I forgot we can use the Skull Masher now. We got this from the Diamond Loot Room the other day, but that really feels like cheating. All right, so we'll use the Huntress first. All right, Huntress. 
I don't like these snipers with no actual sight on them. Kind of defeats the purpose of a sniper, in my opinion, you know? Oh, okay. Ozzo sent me. Oh, look at Ozzo with the hookup. All right. So Ozzo, being the awesome dude that he is, he sent me all of the mission reward items that he's gotten while doing a 100% run at max level so that when we get there, we can test them out at max level. Leave a comment down below just saying Ozzo is awesome. Skullmaster is just literally chopping people into pieces. That was a two for one sale right there. Finally, yes. <laughs> Sledge's shotgun. As you can see, there's the damage compared to the Garcia that we were rocking. Yeah, it's pretty good, guys. Pretty good on normal mode. Not really something you'd want to use on, you know, Mayhem 11. Now we got the pause rifle. Hold on. While we're here, we got to ride the roller coaster, guys. Wait, there's a roller coaster? Hell yeah, there is. Nope. 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 Okay, what? <laughs> oh, jump snipes. Wesley, jump snipes. Who's still alive? You? Jump snipe. You? Jump snipe. Woo! <laughs> you wish the Skull Master was good? What? Every world drop we've gotten has been a Jacobs, it feels like, you know? Yeah, I wish the Skull Master was stronger, though. Like, that's so weak. All right, pause, rival. Let's go. No, 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 no. Okay, I missed I missed a lot of shots right there. All right, let's give her some hell. You guys ready? Damn. Too bad the Skull is so weak, guys. In case you're wondering how to get an XP booster, this is free and available to anybody if you own the game and you have an active internet connection. Come to Tannis' lab, Borderlands Science Machine, play this thing for, you know, five, 10 minutes or whatever. You'll get some points, as you can see up there in the top. 500 points or more, you can buy a booster. Ooh, a new executor. Weapon reload speed, mag size. Very nice. <laughs> Let's try and keep track here. So when we started, we had 49,000. And we are only one room in and we're now at 207,000 with loot explosion on. Just saying. Oh, hello. Hello. Seeing dead. Action skill damage. Seeing dead, baby. Keep our action skill up all day. There we go. Now we got the Melter Masher. Mayhem 4. So it's on level with what we're doing. Yeah, this is a good get for this. Would have been better to have it like right at the beginning of this DLC, but you know, whatever, I guess. More hearts, please. Nope. 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 <laughs> nope. Alec? Nope. Alec, no! That wasn't my fault. <laughs> this thing is very inaccurate from range. Nope. <laughs> I missed the stationary bottle. That bottle was moving 100 miles an hour on my screen. Come on. Ah, well, it's Jacobs and it's Rowan's call. That's actually pretty good. You know what? Actually, I'm not even mad. That's amazing. This might get intense, dudes. Oh, ho, 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 companion. Level up, 58. Level up. Damn, another level up. We do level up fast here in the slaughter shaft. Gatling gun. Hey, we don't have to go farm that. Level up again. Leveling up here is more fun to me than scrap traps or Kanagawa. Level up again, man. Oh my God. This is a fun way to level up if you ask me. If you got a good piece of gear that can carry you like this Roan's call is. Holy cow, it's pretty dope. All right, so we're here on Meridian Metroplex because we want to go do the kill kilovolt mission so we can get the one pump chump before we hit max level because I know at Mayhem 11, it's probably not going to do so good. So I want to get it at Mayhem 4 and maybe it'll do some work on Mayhem 4. We'll see. All right, now to summon him, you do need to come to this part of the map right here. It's underground. And what you want to do is you want to come over to this thing here and you click the lever, click the lever again. Then you spin the wheel and nothing on the first run. What we're going to do is we're going to go up to the top of the stairs here and trigger the save station here. And that is located right here on the map. And this is going to be your closest save station for this farm. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, Whoa, we got it. <laughs> give me this, give me this, give me this. There it is. The one pump jump. We got it at Mayhem 4. So let's see how it feels at Mayhem 4. Not too horrible. It's not, you know, one tap. Okay. Not bad. Not amazing, but it's not. All right, cool. All right, one pump chump. Come on now. I feel like I've heard my wife say this. What did he say? All right, it's time for a Royal Rumble here in this jungle. All right, well, that's no first run head explosion, unfortunately. Ooh, time 16 stagecoach, Sentinel active. Hey, you. <laughs> game over, man. It's game over. Oh, here we go. Finally got the head explosion. Let's try this thing out. I got a barrel. 
Take oh. that, you stuck up. <laughs> First kill, we got the queen's call. So nice. And a cloning hex. Nice. All right. Explosion. 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 Dude, the explosion is feeling pretty good in here, man. <laughs> oh my god. They all just exploded, dude. All right, we got us some drops. <gasps> Oh my god! Yep, and naturally the first revolter we get no anointment because we're on the M4. Come on, baby. Single active double spike movement speed. <laughs> All right, I'm cool with that. Let's go ahead and just jump into DLC 2 and blast through that. Come on, go into the pit. Oh crap, that was a Mr. President. <laughs> Phoenix University tip for you guys. If you are out of ammo, let's say for example, we are out of everything over there. All you have to do is bust one of these fish nets inside of this DLC and it maxes your ammo out. As you saw just a minute ago, we were down to like 70 something bullets in our shotgun and then boom, instantly completely refilled. A mock. How about an unseen threat right off the bat? I cannot believe how good this Rowan's call still does. <laughs> First run unseen threat. Ooh, baby. Damn, I like the unseen throat. So now we got the cure, level 70 cure. Pretty good damage on the thing. Let's try it out. We get no anointment on it. Critchy. Kill Critchy with the cure. I tried to. Unseen threat for me and the clone. Let's see how this goes. Oh my god, dude. Popping heads. Team head pop. Boom! Level 71. One more level to go. Can't believe we're almost already level 72. Ooh, how about a void rift? Yes, we got a void rift. Yes. Dudes, if you guys have never used the Void Rift, it is a highly underrated shield. The cool thing about the Void Rift is it is a Impaler and a Black Hole Shield combined, but it actually feels pretty good. Hey, bust my shield. It'll be hilarious. Hey, you bust my shield. <laughs> Tell me that's not great. All right, we got it. Yes. Little Yeeti. Hells yeah. All right, we got Whoa, that one definitely got yeeted. Nope, 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 nope. Oh my god. Nope. Okay, listen. Nope. Listen, okay. All right, we got rewarded for our accuracy by uh, getting that those drops. <laughs> Level 72. Wait, ow. <laughs> Everlock, what? Yo. Okay, you know what? Old you, that's fine. <laughs> I don't know what killed me there. Okay, what else do I have? Oh yeah, the Dakota. The Dakota's good. The Dakota from DLC 3. I like this shotgun a lot, man. This feels damn good to use, man. We can actually go ahead and get our Bird of Prey now. Boom. Then I need a Blade Fury. Boom. Oh, man, we got it. A freaking Blade Fury Masher. I like that the damage is twice the Wedding Invitation damage. <laughs> Can't believe nobody uses the Wedding Invitation. That thing seems like it's amazing. Let's go get our Hellwalker out of the way. Oh, oh, hey! Oh yeah, now we're talking. Let's grab our clairvoyance and then go get the sea and dead because with the clairvoyance, we'll be able to kill the jackpot even faster. This time I'm gonna do me and clone both using the wedding invitation. Damn, are we killing shit with the wedding invitation? Just, just making sure that that says Mayhem 11, right? Holy crap. Uh, Renfried redeemed, throw your next legendary off of a cliff. Let's hope we get a random world drop legendary here and not a clairvoyance. Come on, wedding. <laughs> Guys, there was a hole in the floor over there. Son of a bitch, Renfried. All right, well, the good news is it wasn't a good one. So off of a cliff it goes. Bye. Come on, baby. A dastardly clairvoyance with action skill active weapon damage. All right. It's not full auto. I want full auto because I'm lazy and I don't want to have to pull the trigger every time. Oh, baby. What we got? Oh, no, you bitch. All right, to the lost loot machine. And we got a dastardly clairvoyance masher. Wow. That might be pretty good. <laughs> it has the uh, Sentinel Cryo. Now let's go back to the Jackbot. And see if we can get us a dope ass seeing dead. Whoa, there we go. We got a bunch on that one. We got five on this run. All right. Nope. Nope. Oh boy. Over three. Light off and doll. Oh, great. And son of a bitch. Not a single Jacobs one. Disappointed. You know what I really want to get next is a Icebreaker Victory Rush. Easy peasy, right? So you're dead, you can quit talking. Oh! I mean, we didn't get the greatest rolls at the bottom, but damn. Hey, look at that, we got the Ionic Disruptor. There's a Jacob's gun that we haven't gotten yet. You melee them, and then you get extra damage on them, right? Got you. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> nope, 
Nope. We need a piss grenade. There we go. It's piss grenade damage. And we are. Oh, hold up. Flash damage radius, weapon critical damage. It's only got one to the bonus projectiles though. Now to get the Becca, you have to complete all the hammerlock hunts. That's why we're here on Athena's. We need to go across the map and get our first hammerlock hunt kill of the day. Disrupted, bitch. I get disrupted. Ionic disruptor is being kind of fun over here, guys. <laughs> Gotta be honest, I'm having a little bit of fun with this ionic disruptor thing. All right, Chupacabra, get flooded. Get flooded. All right, there we go. That's one more hammerlock hunt down. Hold on, we need to go to Sanctuary and look into his room and see what we haven't killed. Lavender Crawley. Is that the... Oh, no. And Phoenix. Ah! Good job, clone. Good job, clone. You're doing great over there. Got a radio dead deathless. So now the only one we have left is the Crawleys. Wish I had a frozen heart. I'd just freeze the shit out of everything right now. I'm scared to give Clone the Hellwalker because I'm afraid he'll like launch him off the map. You know what I mean? All right, we got mail. Oh boy. Quick draw Becca. All right. I don't know what max damage is. Also, look, we can get another Becca. And look, we can get another Becca. And look, we can get another. And then why not? Let's get another. <laughs> How do you get those keys? Uh, level up your vault cards. That's one way to do it. Speaking of, I think, uh, yeah, I have a chest available. When you open up a chest. Lucky. I am king of the timing, aren't I? <laughs> Sorry, we did get a uh, clairvoyance masher on the wall. Hey, did we finally get it? Nope. Son of a Come on, man. That's not it either. Took me a second. Yo, thank you, Zorprom. Yay, we don't have to go back to the diamond loot room. So Zorprom sent me the ultra rare seventh sense purple variant that you can only get in the diamond loot room now i've gotten a bunch of these over the years i want to say i've gotten like four of these now so let's uh let's show what i can do you can only get this from the diamond loot room not bad get down from there dummy <laughs> thank you hey we finally got it gatland trick mutant as you can see the damage is just so good let's go kill something with it the revolter it doesn't seem so bad right this thing's basically like a tickle torture gun without the revolter. <laughs> I don't remember what this thing does, or does it just pure ricochet? I, I can't remember what it does. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh, hello. <laughs> we got the flood. I don't have to go farm it. Yay. Chaotic Goblin redeemed. Throw your next legendary off of a cliff. We don't have anything good coming up. You sure you want to use that right now? <laughs> well, there you go. Throw your next legendary off a cliff redeemed by our man, Chaotic Goblin. He was taking a chance. He said, this playthrough has been very lucky for you. So there was always a chance that we would have got something, you know, worthwhile. But he took the chance and instead he gets a stone. He legendary. Wow. Another flood. Pearl of ineffable knowledge. Watch this be like a really good one. Max health and health regen. <laughs> <laughs> on the character who only needs one single point that's great as in it's terrible actually is what i'm trying to say oh what the hell dude all right the unforgiven so that's better than our 300 percent crit damage one that we had earlier dude the reload on this thing is awesome ready and boom <laughs> the unforgiven <laughs> and this isn't even like the max crit damage unforgiven we didn't even get the best one Okay. <laughs> okay. Unforgiven's just dumb. Thank you. Oh my god. I didn't think we were never getting this stupid thing. <laughs> yes, the bloom. All right. Now <laughs> we got it. Quite a bit of a damage upgrade over the uh the love drill. Consecutive hits, you know? That's all right. <laughs> it was how he stopped in place and spun and then <laughs> helicopter, helicopter. Well, 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 well. This has been one of the craziest, most fun playthroughs I've ever done. And we've taken our time on this playthrough. A lot of times on the playthroughs, I like to try and get it done, but like day seven, day eight at the most. On this one, I'm like, you know what? I'm taking my time. All right, so Phoenix University lesson for you guys. When you do We Slash part three and you kill Aista, the quote unquote invincible, leave him dead. Do not revive him. Then what you can do is you can just save and quit. And when you come back in, he will die as soon as you load in and drop his loot. So you run over there and and there's a chance that you get a skull masher and a cocky bastard without having to kill him again all right as you can see boom skull masher that's a mag load one right yeah not bad so you don't have to individually load bullets he we got our cocky bastard now we've gotten all the drops from him it's time now we got our skull masher we got our cocky bastard we do need to go get the seventh sense nope 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 
Nope. Nope. Okay. Let me. Let me really. I'm, I'm, con I'm gonna concentrate. Did we get it? We got the seven cents. Much higher damage. I really wish I could identify what each side was just by looking at it, but I can't. All right, moment of truth. We're gonna get anything good? Got a rang. Devil's foursome. Hey, we got another companion. A hellwalker and a night oven. All right. Hey, at least we got some loot. All right, before we do the trials, let's go get a lucky seven on level. First run. Lucky seven. There's a scene of dead. Jacob's weapon damage and weapon accuracy. That's the best one we've gotten so far. Can you just strafe my shotgun shot? Oh, Mr. President. Skull masher coming up. Candido is right. A dastardly with more damage, action skill, active weapon damage. Nice. And into the void with my Rowan's call. We got a Rowan's call. Now we just got to go retrieve her from the lost loot. Ah, it's shock. All right. Damn, Rowan's call. So freaking good, dude. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! That is head. Bam. Lucky seven. Kill stacks. <laughs> okay. Damn! All right. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. Team of War is down. We just need him to drop us a Jacob's Company, man. No big deal. Hey! Yes! Fight for your life movement speed. You have Jacob's damage on it. Jacob's fire rate. Jacob's accuracy. <laughs> hey, Jacob's company man. Jacob's damage. Jacob's critical damage. Jacob's accuracy. All right. The bottom roll is not the greatest. Jacob's damage. Jacob's critical damage. And it's 50% on the critical damage. 50% on the accuracy. Yes. All right. Here's the skill tree. Blueberry punch to the cap. We got pumpkin spice to the cap. We got Mountain Dew just sitting there empty as hell. And then we got the grape Kool-Aid tree down to art of war that's right no eraser don't need it so i guess maybe let's start things off by going and doing the cartels now if you guys ever want to do the cartels or the bloody harvest event you can do them at any time now they are permanent additions to the game and everybody has them as long as you have an active internet connection no dlc required they just come included with the base game just like the mountain take down guardian take down proven grounds all that stuff so all you do is you hit play you go down to events where it says events disabled and you just switch to whichever one you want bloody harvest gets you with captain haunt and the Halloween stuff. Broken Hearts Day gives you the hearts that you can shoot. You get the wedding invitation, polyamorous. And then you got Revenge of the Cartels. And this is where we're going to start. This gives you Joey Ultraviolet and Vila Ultraviolet, which is one of my favorite maps in all of Borderlands history. So let's go do that. Ooh, that was nice. <laughs> Am I using the frozen snowshoe? No, but it, let's do that on this run. Let's put it on. We don't need the revolter. Oh man, Jacob Zane is freaking great. <laughs> it's freaking so good, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, clone, let's do this. Frank, okay. <laughs> I didn't know that guy was even there, bro. One's like, I don't have time to wait for you to figure out who is spawned and who hasn't. I've already murdered them all. Now we gotta kill Joey Ultra V. Oh, this is a raid boss, by the way. The hell is happening? Woo! Kill another raid boss. Oh my God. I mean, hitting crits is the problem here, but. An overflowing scream of terror, which can't be anointed. Oh my God. Sheesh. Holding back burner. More faster fired tizzy. Oh God. Oh God. I'm gonna do this solo clone. Yeah. Oh, you're not dead. Yeah! <laughs> and we got a wood blocker. Woo! <laughs> and a Maggie with max damage and life steal. And a Maggie with not max damage. Hey, we got an executor. Weapon damage, shotgun damage, action skill, cooldown rate. It's a Hellwalker one right there, dude. Let's go and knock out Guardian takedown, because that one's the <laughs> you know. That one's not even letting him get out of the portal before he's got him halfway dead every time. Get off my platform. Be a distraction, clone. Be a distraction. My boy is a good distraction. Uh oh. Almost didn't make that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we good, baby. We good. We got this shit. And I love this fight, man. I love that you have to move and dodge this shit. I do wish it went a little bit faster sometimes, but. Damn. I hit every one of those shots. I'm not used to that. Hey, we got a plague bear. Nice. Surprise. <laughs> oh, nice. I've never done that before. Bro, we are kicking this dude's ass. We're just kicking his ass right now, man. He's trying to kill my clone. I don't appreciate that. 
Yeah, keep shooting him, clone. Keep shooting him. He's not done. He's not done, clone. All right, we got a chaos in. A recursion. Smog. All right. That was for our Moe's playthrough. I told you guys we'd get it. I just didn't, you know, didn't know it'd take this long. Oh, you know what we haven't done in a long time? We haven't jumped into the turret. It's been forever since we did this. Can't remember the last time we jumped into the turret. Chuck Lee, bitch! <laughs> Right, I blade furied him to death. All right, lead sprinkler. Show him what it can do, clone. Teach him about the ways of the lead sprinkler. Oh, okay, lead sprinkler suck. Back up, baby. Back up, baby. And there's the takedown. Yay, loot. We did it. I actually love the look of this map. I don't know what it is. I just like this little arena here. I actually like the companion a lot, man. I like the feel of it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just feels good to shoot it. Oh, tremendous. Rick. Wow. That was, that was a, that was a close fight, guys. Close fight. What do we have left? The seer, okay, let's do it. All right, the seer, basically a raid boss. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Pretty good, pretty good so far. <laughs> what just happened? Hollow point, did I hit a hollow point? Yeah, I think it was just a hollow point and he was standing so close. To that dude that I murdered in front that it just obliterated him. The Jacob's Allegiance Zane is over. It has been an absolute blast. I have had a lot of fun and we capped it off with a crazy kill on Seer who has an insane amount of health. Hope you guys have enjoyed this playthrough as much as I did. If you did, hit that like button, hit subscribe, tap the bell icon for more. And the next playthrough will be Hyperion Flak. I hope to see you guys on that. Y'all have a wonderful day. Take care.